What's up guys, hello Shiro Toy Reviews, doing another um, brief unboxing slash review slash showcase type of thing. Um, so I picked up, I went to the comic book store yesterday, the closest one near me. Um, I picked up a handful of mini mates, um, this box set being one of them. Um, Marvel Secret Invasion box set, um, which is actually a pretty cool uh, set of figures. Um, I also picked up, let's see, uh, this old Marvel Mini Mate, Marvel or Marvel Universe, um, two pack of Beast and Kitty Pride. Um, I'm a big Shadow Cat fan. That's Kitty's uh, field name or superhero name. Um, and also, I got something which I was also interested in: um, Street Fighter Cross Tekken. Um, this is Sagat and King, or Tiger King. Um, yeah, so I kind of got these this set randomly, but I do like some of the figures um, in this wave. Um, and yeah, I was thinking about, I'll probably open them. Um, but yeah, um, but real quick, before, because the meat and potatoes of this review is going to be the Secret Wars box set. Um, I want to show off my... Um, some of my mini mates I have on display currently. Um, so this is the Days of Future Past uh, Magneto and um, Future Professor X two pack. Um, so I think I've stated before in previous reviews, but I'm not a big fan of movie based figures. I'm more like figures that are based off the comics or. They're video game characters. They look like their video game counterparts. Um, I've never been too big on movie action figures with the exception of like Transformers or maybe like old Spider-Man movies or something. Oh, but yeah. Excuse me. Um, but I really do like this Magneto and um, Professor X. Um, the detail on them is nice, even though they're wearing all black, which I actually think looks cool, even though nothing that they're wearing has an X logo on it. So that would really be my only gripe. Like, if you looked at these two characters and you haven't seen Future Past, you maybe could figure out who they were. The wheelchair would probably give Professor X away. But yeah, nothing on their outfits says X-Men, so it's kind of my only gripe. But I really do like these two. Um, and I have my Destiny. She is another X-Men character. Um, she's blind and she's also old. Um, so I thought she looked cool having three old, three old mutant characters together would look cool. So I just took her head and put it on my storm. So they all be wearing matching black outfits. Um, but yeah, the three of them look good together. Um, she's a solid figure. I got her in one of my uh, Mini Mate lots that I bought. Um, but yeah, showing some X-Men love. Um, so next we have Beast and Kitty. Now these figures are early kind of Mini Mate figures. Um, these came out in 2006. Um... Yeah, so these came out in 2006, and they are, I still think they hold up nicely. Um, my only gripe is that usually mini mates that have uh, hair pieces, they have little pegs that you can stick into the head to hold the hair onto the head. Well, these don't. So, um, <laughs> Kitty's is staying on right now. But hers wasn't really staying on that well when I took her out. But Beast, his stays on there pretty securely. Um, but yeah, the detail on them is nice. I believe th these designs are based off Astonishing X-Men. Um, so yeah, I really do like them. And one thing I noticed is that Kitty on the packaging doesn't have the X logo on her belt, which I think is interesting. Um... Also, we have the other figures that were available at the time. So that's pretty cool. And I did see Wolverine and Cyclops. 
I was about to say Cyclossus. Um, I did see Wolverine and Colossus um, at the store, but I didn't get them. Um, but yeah, I really do like these two. Uh, Kitty's probably my favorite. And now I own three Beasts, Mini, mini Mates. And lastly, we have, which I'll be doing a review on, um, Secret Invasion Mini Mates, uh, Wolverine, Phoenix, Jessica Jones, and Beast. He loves you. I'm not sure what that's referring to. And here are how they looked with their scroll um, heads. It's interesting. Um... So this is the back of the packaging. Um, you get four extra skull heads included. You rotate the heads for scroll transformation. That's pretty cool. So yeah, I think I'm about displaying these. Um, and if you want to read that, usually I would, but I'll let you guys read it. Because um, it's kind of a lot. And there is the bio for Phoenix and Beast. So, yeah. Alrighty then, so on to the review. Okay, here they are. Um, so first impressions, these figures are cool. I do like the aesthetic of all of them. Um, since, they were, since they are a little bit older, they did not come with display stands. Um, the only person who came with an accessory, if you don't count the scroll heads, is Wolverine. Um, but yeah, I mean, they all look cool. Um, Jessica um, looks like Jessica Jones from this period, from this era. I like her hair, I like her face, all nicely detailed. Let's see, it says... If I can get it to 2009. Wow, so I was nine years old when these mini-mates came out. It's crazy. Um, yeah, but she's cool. I like the detail on her. Um, I would say Wolverine and maybe Jean are my favorites. Um, here's Wolverine. This looks more like his first appearance look, so I'm not sure if that's what they were going for. Um, can never go wrong with Wolverine. Let's see if I could get his cowl off with one hand. So I just took it off. Nope, it's not one to come off. Yeah, it's not one to come off. Um, but yeah, he looks cool. So I always, always love Wolverine. I'm a Wolverine fan. So, never go wrong with Wolverine. Next, we have Phoenix or Jean Grey. Um, I don't own a Phoenix, so at least in minifigure form. So this is cool. I like her facial expression. But yeah, um, Secret Wars or Secret Invasion. Yeah, Secret Invasion. I, I have to read up on it. I'm a little familiar with that storyline. Um... I always thought the scroll were cool antagonists or cool alien race, um, mostly affiliated with the Fantastic Four. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to read up on Secret Invasion. Um, so my least favorite is Beast, and I love Beast. I'm a Beast fan, but I just don't like the aesthetic of this version of him. I don't like how the hair looks. It looks very, I guess, kind of realistic and not. Real, real big like it usually is. Um, oh, but yeah, but yeah, he's okay. He's my least favorite. I like that other beast that came with Kitty more. Um, oh, and lastly, I will show my two other figures that I opened. I went ahead and open. Um, I give him Stan. So King and Sagat. Oh, King fell. <laughs> King fell over. Um, I'll just show him like this. So yeah, I really like King. Um, he's very cool, very cool looking, very kind of over the top. He has a tail. Um, I really like the aesthetic of him. He's he's a wrestler, to my knowledge. He's a pro wrestler. 
or mass wrestler. Um, so he's cool. And then we have Sagat, who is, of course, from Street Fighter. I always thought Sagat was cool. I like his design. I like he has a big scar on his chest left by Ryu. Um, that's dope. So, and lastly, last but not least, we get these four scroll heads. So, two male heads. If I can get it to focus. Two male head, two male head heads, my bad, and one female head. I mean, and two female heads. Get my words mixed up. Um, yeah, and they're all nice, nicely detailed. This is cool. So I am going to display these guys as scroll for a little while, and then eventually I will probably put them back on their packaging and put them on my wall. But, um, so I will show how they look as scroll. Alrighty, finally we have them in their scroll form. And like I said, this is a very cool set to for them to have made. Um, with the swappable, uh, with turning the heads around and giving us swappable heads. Um, like I said, I'm not the biggest fan of Secret Invasion. Um... So originally, this this uh, box set really didn't appeal to me, but it was it was kind of limited on what they had as far as mini mates um, at the, at the store, and I wanted to go home with the box set. So this one appealed to me the most out of what they had available. Um, but yeah, get Wolverine to focus. There we go. Yeah, so. Um, so yeah, that's it for this review, guys. Uh, next reviews will be possibly Transformers, because I do have, I still have that knockoff Defensor and the Human Alliance Bumblebee I still want to talk about or show off. So stay tuned for that. But, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Peace, you guys.